Hello there, this is David from Cisco Tech. On this video, I will be presenting how to configure dial peer groups on a Cisco Unified Border Element. Dial peer groups can be configured on queue platforms running from iOS version 15.4.1.t and in platforms running iOS XC software from version 3.11s onwards. This feature will group multiple iPhone dial peers into a dial peer group. Then, we can configure this dial peer group as the destination target of an inbound dial peer. In simpler words, we will limit the outgoing dial peer hunting to a select group of dial peers, depending on the incoming dial peer we match at the moment the call arrives at the cube. Once we have an incoming call reaching the cube, it will hunt and match an incoming dial peer. If that incoming dial peer has a dial peer group configured, it will invoke it. And then the cube will perform the hunting of the outgoing dial peer exclusively on the dial peers configured within the dial peer group. Even when you have a valid match criteria on another outbound dial peers, the dial peer hunting to route the call out will only take place between the members of the dial peer group. Finally, we will have a match on an outbound dial peer, and the call will be routed to the destination configured on it. As you can see here, on this cube, we already have some incoming and outgoing dial peers configured. Remember that we can differentiate between incoming dial peers and outgoing dial peers, as the latest ones have a session target configured on them to route the call out. In this example, we have two incoming dial peers, dial peer 10 and dial peer 20, to match the calls coming from different locations. Besides that, the rest of our dial peers from 11 to 15 and from 21 to 25 are outgoing dial peers with a session target on it in order to route the call out. To configure a dial peer group, let's begin by entering to the configuration mode of the router. On global mode, we enter configuration terminal command and we press enter. Now, Let's define a dial parent group entering the command voice class dial peer group and then assigning a numeric label to it. In this case, we will define a dial peer group 100. Afterwards, we can define the group of album dial peers who want to do the hunting. We can also configure a preference to define the order in which we want this hunting to be executed. So, for this dial peer group 100, we are going to include dial peer 11 with preference 1, dial peer 12 with preference 2, dial peer 13 with preference 3, dial peer 14 with preference 4, and dial peer 15 with preference 5. We then go back to global mode entering N and pressing Enter. Once we have our dial peer group defined, we just need to invoke it in the incoming dial peer of our preference. In this case, let's configure it in a manner in which the dial peer group 100, including outbound dial peers 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, is invoked when matching the incoming dial peer 10. So, we enter again to the configuration mode, we enter to a dial peer 10, and then we enter the destination dpg command. We can do the same thing with the other incoming dial peer and the rest of our outbound dial peers. Finally, to verify the dial peer group is properly set up, we can make use of the show voice class dpg command. If everything is working fine, we will see a list of the outgoing dial peers we configure within the dial peer group. I hope you found this video useful and thank you for watching.